balance the chemical equation. Let's take a look at this equation representing the chemical reaction. In this equation, the reactants are lead nitrate and potassium iodide, and the products are potassium nitrate and lead iodide. If we look at this equation, we can see that the equation is not balanced. In the reactants side, there are one plumbum atom, two nitrogen atoms, six oxygen atoms, one potassium atom, and one iodine atom. And the products side, there are one plumbum atom, one nitrogen atom, three oxygen atoms, one potassium atom, and two iodine atoms. The number of atoms is not balanced on both sides. To balance the chemical equation, we need to make use of coefficients. A coefficient is a number that we place in front of a chemical formula. In this equation, we need to balance the nitrogen atoms first. To do this, we need to put a coefficient of 2 in front of KNO3. The nitrogen atoms and oxygen atoms are balanced. Now we need to balance the potassium and iodine atoms. To do this, we need to put a coefficient of 2 in front of KI. The equation is now balanced. There are one plumbum atom, two nitrogen atoms, six oxygen atoms, two potassium atoms, and two iodine atoms on both sides. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel and press on the bell icon.